Good morning, guys. I'm Peter Rubalcaba, the Kleeman TSM for the West Coast. Today, we are in front of the Kleeman Sculper Screen MSS 802 Evo. This machine features a 16 by 5 screen box. It will let you fit any type of screen media from screen mesh to punch blade to grizzly bars for heavy duty applications. The feeder will have two types of options. You will have the standard belt feeder or you will have the apron feeder for heavy duty applications or applications where you are facing any type of rebar or steel. Another key feature of this machine is that you will be able to change the inclination of the screen box to adapt the machine to any application you have. One of the things you will notice is that we have moved away from the hydraulic levers and now everything is controlled through a remote control on the side of the machine. This will let you start the machine with just one button and it will allow you to control every aspect of the machine from the inclination of the belts to the speed of the conveyors. This new control system that we feature will allow you to do everything from one single spot safely away from the machine. One of the great facts of this machine is that it's the first ever built in-house machine in the history of crushing and screening. The machine is built by Working Group and the engine is a John Deere engine. One thing you'll notice whenever you walk into this engine compartment, you're gonna have plenty of room and full access from both sides of the engine to do any scheduled maintenance or require service. In addition to this, something you'll notice is the accessibility and serviceability of this machine. One of the key features is that you will be able to raise up the screen box all the way to the top to have full access to the bottom deck of the machine. This machine features a John Deere telematics. You'll be able to have access to both your yellow iron John Deere equipment and your Kleeman information in one single system. This MSS 802 features the interlink system. It will allow machines to talk to each other via cable through the e-stop systems, and it will also allow you to use the ultrasonic sensor in the front of the machine to slow the feeder up and down whenever you have a machine in front of you. Talking about sustainability, this machine also features a dual power option in which we will be able to connect the machine to external power without having to turn on the engine. If you have any other questions or want to know more, please visit our website.